guys welcome back to my channel hope you're doing all right um sorry that monday's video wasn't that much wasn't that long um but to be fair maybe it's a good thing getting along so he goes to there watch for hours watching me just clean and me set you know what i mean so um i'm gonna do a weekly vlog um well kind of a weekly vlog because obviously we already missed out monday but you know it is what it is um at the minute i'm doing some tweet i've just had louise and craig here um they brought some stuff up for me and my sister um they popped in to say hello and that lot like, see the cats um and now they've gone um i did have a parcel delivery this morning but i missed it um but it's been re-delivered for tomorrow so that's fine i'm gonna be in tomorrow anyway um so yeah monday night kind of went downhill so I got to my granddad's, got into my pajamas, and I started having pain in my knee, my ankle, my big toe was throbbing. So yeah, and then literally I've, my granddad's gone to bed, I've literally sat down in the living room, um, gone to put a can on the floor, missed, literally fell out of my hands, hit my foot, so I've got a bruise at the top of my foot. Um, and then I had stomach ache most of the night and most of today. So I don't know whether it's going to become that time of the month. I don't know because at the minute all I'm doing is spotting. Yes, I'm doing a hot water bottle. Because all I'm doing at the minute is just spotting. So I don't know whether um, I'm having another period or what. But the spotting is like really, really light. So I don't know. But we'll just see how things go. Anyway, like... It's fine anyway because obviously I've got stuff I need to do around here anyway because um, I've done the one balcony door um, that's been done. I just need to do. So the one balcony door has been done. Um, so that's fine. Um, I got some of the stuff for the balcony door today when I was up in the ice street and I've done the one, I just need to do the other one tomorrow. Um, I'll do that once uh, the bloke's been with the parcel. And then once the bloke's been with the parcel, then I'll get straight on to doing it. If you can hear the oven going off, it's because I'm just doing something to eat. Um, I'll show you what I'm having in a minute, hold on. Let me just, put that kettle back on there because I need to do two more hot water bottles. So the, what I'm having to eat today is nothing really fancy. I just I just wanted some easy and quick to do. So my grandma got me these from Iceland. These are the um, our cheese and ham hash brown mini toasties. They are really nice. So yeah, um, I've I've only got two pack of these and I've put five in to add them out. Oh. My granddad wasn't really keen on them, but hey, oh, I don't know what I like. So I'm just going to put this in the bed and not back. If you can see the bag behind me, that just has, like, oh, that bag there, the one with the flower inside, that just has all the bags, the carry bag in, because I had a carry bag in and now I've got that bag in bag um i'm just pulling them there now so that i can fold them up and pull them into the bag in the um other cupboard oh my so yeah guys how have you all been hope you're all doing well hope you had a nice weekend mine was all right to be fair um i know i didn't done the video on friday of the girls night and the day that went really well actually to be honest um we chilled her hers until her boyfriend got back. Then he looked after the kids when we went out for we were out for a girly night. Um, we went to we was gonna go weather spoons, but then when we looked at the time it was a little bit late so we, and our our, pic, our uh, movie started at nine. So what we did instead we had food at the cinema which um, they'd done like this meal deal where you have a pizza a side and then a drink so i had the plate the cheese and tomato pizza with um potato wedges and the um tango ice blast i had the blue and the pink in so i had it mixed um and then because we already went to pound shop when we first got there to get like a load of snacks and drinks 
So I already had a bottle of Coke and I already had a few snacks, which to be fair, I didn't really eat. Then while we was waiting, we went into Costa, had a look at Costa. Um, she had a cake, I had a, cake, a few cakes, and then we went into the cinema. So yeah. The film was really, really good to be honest. Like really good. Hold on a minute guys, let me just pour this and then I'll come back to you because obviously I can't. But yeah, so we went to watch The Night Swim. Um, it, was, it was good, really good to be fair. Um, very jumpy. Like very jumpy. Uh, to be fair there wasn't that many people in there to be honest um, there was me and my mate there was two behind us on not the one where we was there was another row and then that, that's where they was um, there was over on that side at the top there was a line of people there and then there was two down at the front um, so yeah so the movie night went good. It was it was nice to be fair to have a girls' night. Um, we've decided to do it like once a month to have a girls' night because obviously having a girls' night is nice. Let me, I'll be back here. Let me just put this in the bed. So guys, I'm back. I've got one last walk bother to do. Um, and then my shoe food should be ready. Let me just pause this and see. So my food is done in, a, in, a, in like a few seconds. Um, my alarm will go off anyway when it's done. So we set my alarm. As soon as I put the food in the oven, I set my alarm for how many minutes it's going to be in there. Um, it had to be in for 15 minutes, so it's nearly done. So by the time the food's done, then I can, let's get the plates ready. So there, I always have ketchup on my food. Normally I have barbecue, but I forgot to pick barbecue up. So I'm just gonna have to put up with this for now. And then I'll, I'm gonna have to get another one of these to be fair. Like look how much is left of it. Oh geez. I don't know why man, but I just love sauce. I never really put salt on my food. Like I'm more of a sugar person than a salt person. So uh, yeah, my alarm's just gone off. So now I'm just gonna put this, actually I'm gonna turn the oven off quickly just so that it doesn't overcook it and I'm just going to put the hot water in my hot, wa my hot water bottle. How many times in this video can I say hot water bottle? Like really? I'm just going to put the water in this then give it get the food out because I'll take this hot water bottle with me when I get the, when I do the food. There we go, that's that done. There we go, so that's that one done. Let me just go and get my food out now. Oh. Hot, 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 hot. So let me double this over. So this is what they look like. They're just like little squares and they're very nice. <gasps> that one was hot. To be fair, they're all up, but you know. There we go, put that in here. I'm just putting water in it so it cools it down a bit because it was really hot. Now I'm going to put some sauce on. So, there we go. That is my food for today. Um, let's go into the bedroom to watch my TV. So, I am now watching a different one now because I've completely finished Criminal Minds now and I'm not very happy about it either, to be honest. I think I should have done more, but hey-ho, whatever it is. Um, so now I am watching NCIS Hawaii. 
Um, I've never actually watched this one. Um, I started watching it ages ago, but then I just I couldn't get into it. So um, I thought, you know what? Let's give it another go. And to be fair, I actually do like it, to be honest. It's like the NCIS normal. It's just Hawaii. So, yeah, I'm going to get on and watch that. But I'll come back to you guys in a bit before... Because I'd, I've, I've got to do something, I'll call for it what I've got to do. But anyway, I'll come back when I've got to do it. So, see you in a bit, guys. Hi, hey guys. Welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm sorry that I'm a bit off with a video in today. Um, I woke up in feeling a bit under the weather, to be honest. Oh. I woke up feeling a bit under the weather. Um, also, just to let you know, um, what are it, what, Friday there'll be a video going up on both my TikToks. It's going to be an unboxing on my Tattoo Lash bundle that I got um, off TikTok. Um, so... If you want to go and have a look at that, then do go over there and have a look. If you want to have a look if what you get in the normal lot of the normal bundle that you get with the uh, tweezers and all that lot, then do check out my TikTok because I have got it on there. I've also got the remover on there and all that lot. So if you want to go and check that out, then go for it. Um, so yeah, so I've had to do two videos of that. Well, I pre-recorded the two videos for both my channel because I accidentally deleted the one. So I had to do it again. So yeah guys, so I now I'm just chilling, um, watching NCIS Hawaii. I've never actually really watched this, but I'm trying to get into it. And to be fair, I have got into it. It is quite good. So yeah, so um, all I've done today is I have done my Spanish. I've meditated. Um, what else have I done? I've done... Oh, excuse me. I've done a few things and I've sorted out a few things. So yeah. So I'm just going to chill, do something to eat in a minute and that's it really. So I thought I'd just pop on because I haven't been on all day and um, I will come back to you in a bit when I'm going to do something to eat. These are the Monchery lashes that I put on um, that I got today. So I've got 16s on the outer corner, two, then I've got two 14s in the middle and then two 14s at the front. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed hope you enjoyed never mind um i will see you back in a bit guys see you in a bit so hi guys i am sorry for the, the shitty video quality today because literally i woke up and i was like uh, can't be asked but then i was like oh gotta go down my mum's to get my tablet so i've come down my mum's to get my tablets plus i brought jamie's stuff down as well so killed two birds with one stone <sighs> So yeah, guys, these are the tatty lashes that I got the other day, the Monchery. To be fair, I didn't like the way that I've done them when I've pulled them on. And I think that's because I didn't put a smaller one on the inner corner, so it looked seamless. But I have changed that now, and now I actually kind of like them even more now, to be honest. But, you know, so yeah. I'll uh, come back in a bit, guys. Okay, so hi, guys. I am back from my mum's. Um, I had to take Jamie's stuff down. Um, then I picked up my tablets which are in the bedroom and now I'm back and I've had a parcel come so let's cover that because I don't want anyone knowing where I live so yeah I've had a parcel come so let's have a look what it is I've already opened it like um, how it's the uh, glow thing so let's open it up and have a look even though I've got to redo this full TikTok video because I've decided I'm going to put two videos up a week on TikTok. I'm staying away from the uh, the editing the cap cut. Cap cut, I think it's called. Because literally I spend way too much time on there. I do too many videos on there. And I'm like, nah, no, nah, not happening. I can't be bothered with it no more. I can't even get this open. I give up, man. Jeez. It's Christ. Bloody hell. I couldn't get that open. So this is the Baby Beam um, Filter Glow Base from Glow Hub. Um, I've never really actually tried anything of theirs. Packaging is nice though, to be fair. So let's get it out. Oh, okay. This one is Shade Beam, Shade Beam, Angel Beam. Um, Let's pull a bit on the back of my hand. Oh, cool, get it on. 
Oh. So I've got a bit on the back of my hand, just rub it around, see? Oh, it's quite nice. Still, let's not keep scratching everything. So that is it. That's quite nice. It's a nice glow. So yeah, so I'm going to put it back in the pack again because I've got to do all this again for TikTok. So at least I just won't have the struggle of, obviously, trying to get it out. So yeah, I've got... um. Let me see how much it was. So, I ordered this on the 21st of January, did I? Bloody hell. Um, one, it, it don't tell you how much it was, to be honest. It just tells you, uh, shipped to me, obviously, the, what the item was called, how, the quantity of it, uh, your order, the day you ordered, and then it's got thank you for shopping with us, and then it's got a like, global of the address. Email if anything's wrong and then website to go on to. So, yeah, that's everything. So, yeah, guys, so I thought I'd just open that one with you because obviously I've opened more parcels on TikTok than I have done YouTube because I had, um, I had two come last week. It was the um, Glow Crop Bundle, which had the, um, the, cleansing balming the primer the white primer from beauty, beauty crop and then the um pink the powder which has the uh yellow lid on which is in the color pink and it come in a nice little bag uh the beauty beauty crop bundle i will try and link it somewhere like along here or if you want my tiktok is down below so you can go and check out them videos um because obviously the so I've I done kind of an upsie before I get on to the other parcels that I got. So I was going for my TikTok the other day, yes, last night, and I thought the video of the two packages, the two parcels I opened with the Beauty Crop and the P. Louise, I'll get back to them in a minute. Um, I thought that was a video that I done yesterday because I had a parcel come yesterday from Tatty Lashes. So I accidentally deleted it and I was like, oh shit. So what I've had to do is I've had to go on, I've had to search uh, to search my other account because what I do is when I do the video, I put them on both my accounts. So like, even if like you just see the story on my uh, Classic Rose Boutique one, you could always go to my Terry Boutique one um, and see the video there because of whatever video I put on my beauty, um, Classic Rose Boutique, I was always put on my other account as well so that both accounts have the same kind of videos. There's only like a few videos that ain't the same, like some of the puzzle ones that I'm on TikTok, I put done them onto uh, my other channel because I don't see the point. But yeah, anyway, and I've accidentally deleted the video on my uh, Classic Rose one. So what I've had to do is go on to my other, I've had to search for my other account sh and share the video of me opening them two box the two parcels and share it onto my my story because obviously i didn't realize i accidentally deleted it so yeah that was brilliant but anyway um so i had the beauty crop um bundle come and i had the p louise juice um juice box um Hold on, let me go and get the stuff. So, so guys, I'm back. Um, I've put most of it all in here. So, this is what come in the Beauty Crop uh, bundle. It was the um, cleansing balm. This is the Beauty Crop featuring um, Grace's faces, which this cleansing balm is really nice because it's got the little spatula as well. Um, also, in the bundle, come with a refill because basically what happens is once you run out of this, just hold on a minute just take this out and then you can put the refill in there and then put the lid on obviously i don't need to put the refill in at the minute because obviously there's still loads left in there um so yeah so we've got that with it then i had this primer that come in the bundle and this powder this is all from the beauty beauty crop um so yeah so i had them to come with me then i had um a headband come with it to do when you do for when you do your makeup and the clips so the clips them in my other 
so I've shared them out. Some of them in this one, some of them in the other one, my skincare one. And then I had this come from P. Louise. So this is the P. Louise Stay Shine Super Hydrating Formula. This is the lip oil, I think it is. Uh, I think it's a lip oil. But yeah, this is what it looks like. I got it in um, popcorn and it is absolutely stunning. I want the donut one, the, um, I want the donut one, I want the pink lemonade one, and I want the, what's the other one? Pink lemonade donut, and, oh shoot, I just dropped that. What else was it? There was another one that I wanted, and I can't think what it's called. Um, I think it's sugar rice or something like that, I think. Um, but yeah, when I order them, do I'll do a video on here of them as well. I'm unboxing them as well because I completely forgot to do it on here as well. So this is the um, P. Louise uh, Protect Your Pout. Pop it like it's hot. This is the lip conditioner. So this is what it looks like. It's got the little key ring to put onto your keys and I love it. But I don't want to put it onto my keys in case I lose it and I don't I won't be very happy then. So all I do is I just pull them back in the box. As I do. Because you know, like I don't I don't want to lose any of this lot. And I could get it back in the thing back in. Oh my okay, foot man. There we go. Got it. Um so yeah, so I'll keep all them in this little box which come from P Louise. Um, I'm going to put that over there with the thing on there. And then the other parcel that caught was the Tatty Lashes one. Um, I will show you what that looks like because obviously I've got them all here. Um, that's the old one, that's the new one, that's the new one. Okay, so obviously this is all my lashes. Um, I've got one of these with all my skincare in. I've got one of these with all my skincare in. I've got well, this one with all my lash stuff in. So that um, it's all separate. Because obviously I need to... When I get the money... When I when I get the money? You know what I mean? When I can, I'm going to get another box of the Tray Chic ones. Because, oh my god, I love these. And guys, that is not the lashes I'll have picked to go with it. So let me just get... Obviously, all the things that come out come in the bundle together. Because um, obviously, like, I want to show you it all. So this is the Tatty Lash Bundle, which is £29. The Lash Bundle is £29 summer. The Beauty Crop Bundle was 30 summer. And then the P. Louise, um, I, I think it's a Bad Bitch juice box or something like that. That was £11 summer we ship and uh, summer we shipping. Can't remember what the shipping was, but anyway. So then let's show you the Tatty Lash stuff. So yeah, we have it. So first off, you get another lot of tweezers, which, you know what I mean? Like, you can never, ever go wrong with tweezers. And when you've got more, it's it's a bonus. So then we get the um, Tatty Lash Cleansing Mist. This is actually really quite good. Before I put this set on, I actually clean my lashes with this. It did go in my eye and it didn't sting at all, which I'm actually very happy about. Then you get the little brush that comes with it. So this is like the little brush. So that's cute. Um, and then you get a removal as well, which is which is really why I actually like this bundle. Because you see, you get the cleanser, you get the glue, you get the lashes, you get the tweezers, you get the brush to clean your lashes with. Um, and then you get the remover to take them off with. It's literally everything you need to put your lashes on maintain and remove like you know what i mean so yeah so and this is a remover i do have this the only thing i didn't have was this the cleansing mist um but this i do have as you can see um and my box is all grotty and everything so yeah so this is really good i'm pretty sure you've seen what it looks like because i'm sure i've done a removal video with you guys and this is what it looks like just in case or if you're new to the channel, I thought I'd just show it again. So, yeah. so I've, But the thing is, what I've done is I've put a circle. So, on here, I've put an O in the corner. So, I know this is the old one that to use first. And then I go on to that one. Um, so, then, 
then we get the glue so as you know i bought the black glue because they didn't have the clear in so i had to get the black one and then when i was ordering this bundle because you can pick what lashes you want and you can pick what glue color glue you want so i went for the clear because i got um a box of black uh bond that's not open and then i got one that's open so now i've got a clear one that's not open and the and one that is open Trust me, wait till you see me comparing these two together. My one that I've been using and the one that I've literally gone. So this is the clean one. No no dirt or nothing. This is my one. This is the one that I've been using. So yeah, you can definitely tell it's been loved a lot because yeah. It it, it is what it is. You know what I mean? Like it is what it is. You know it's good when I constantly reach for it. That is all I'm going to say because obviously, you know what I mean, I clearly reach for this lot every day because, you know what I mean. And then the lashes I put, I picked, sorry guys to disappoint you, but it is not the Trey Chic ones. I picked the Mon Cherie. Now, I actually really like these and you do get um, a booklet with, um, if you've seen my last video on my tatty lashes um you do get a booklet with how to do different styles the lengths that you need to use for it how to pull them on how to remove them then tatty lashes tips i would just hit the side anyway so yeah so these are the monchery oh my god these are brilliant like literally i'm obsessed with these as well so i'm also obsessed with the tray chic ones this is the difference between um like i'm obsessed with both so I need to get both and I'm going to bulk buy both. I'm going to bulk buy both sets because these are actually really good and so are them. These are kind of like that little bit up from a natural lash. That's what these are like um, because they're still quite natural but they're like fluffy and a bit longer. So in here you get a line of 16, two lines of 14s and then you get a line of 12s so yeah and then, but then in the tri chic ones you get a line of 14s a line of 12s a line of 10s and a line of 8s so that is what is difference between these two boxes this is more of the bigger longer lashes these have like quite the everyday simple ones so yeah so but it was really interesting to see how i was going to transition from the tri chic ones to these but actually i kind of looked oh just chucked it over there never mind i kind of love both of them so it is what it is but yeah so and to be fair i've put cotton balls um eyelash curlers uh eyelash brushes and everything in this little set so that it's i've got everything so that's what it all looks like so let's fasten it all to be fair, I kind of did this with my other one, but I had the lashes and my skincare stuff in. But obviously, now that my lashes are getting the lash, my lash um, collection is getting a bit bigger, I thought I'd just put it in a separate one, like the same as my skincare, so that my skincare is in the one of them, and now my lashes are in one of them on their own. So yeah, but yeah, now we can add the baby and um, the glow beam to my collection. So yeah guys um to be fair i think i need to do a little shopping list of all the stuff that i need to repurchase like makeup and skincare wise um so yeah so i need to get two more boxes of lashes i want to get the other lot of p louise's juice boxes so yeah so guys so um yeah i'm gonna get on and have some tweet i might have a bath and that lot so i will come back to you guys in a bit once i start doing food and all that lot because i've got to do, go and do a tiktok video now so i'll be back in a bit guys so hi you guys i am back with another tiktok the one that i did with the tatty lashes video will be up tomorrow because it's friday tomorrow so i'm gonna put it up tomorrow because i'm gonna be doing tiktok videos on a monday and a friday so that you guys have got something to watch on there as well because I want to get a reg I want to get like hold on a minute let's see if it's in the mood. there we go so um yeah I want to get into obviously uploading more on TikTok just not my YouTube but 
my YouTube and TikTok and other social media platforms. But I'm doing one at a time so that, you know. But anyway, we've got another parcel to open. So, yeah, so this come this morning or something like that. So let's cover it so you don't steal my address. So, yeah, I'm just going to open it. So there we go. So I like I like the kind of the, the what they've sent in. So this is the glow hub. This is the baby beam uh Jimmy filter glow base. So this is what it looks like. I love the packaging, like really do like it's so nice. So yeah, so let's open it. I have already done this video on my YouTube channel because obviously I want to open more more parcels on both platforms, so that's what I'm doing. So this is in shade Angel Beam. Oh my god, it feels nice. Like the packaging feels nice. Let's put a bit on the back of my hand. Because obviously I don't want to put loads on at the minute because so that's a bit of it on the back of my hand. Um rubbing it in. Oh look at that glow though. Wow, that's nice. Like, damn, that's nice. So, yeah, so um, I can't remember how much this is. Um, I think it's like... Oh, how much was it? I think it was like £12 with delivery, I think. Don't quote me on that because I don't have a clue how much it was. But, yeah, um, to be honest, the packaging is quite nice. I got the little invoice as well from Global Beauty. Got your order, got the day you order, got who it's shipped to, it's got the item or the name of it in the shade. Um, it's also got the quantity that you've done. So I've only brought one, so it's only got one on there. Then it's got the bottom, thank you for shopping with us, Global Hub Beauty, their address, the customer service e um, email if you need to, and the Glow Hub website. So yeah. To be honest, the way this feels and everything, I really actually want to try the rest of Glow Hub, to be honest, because um it feels quite nice and luxury to be honest but it's it's so cheap though that's the thing like you don't expect it like i'm pretty sure this product was like oh just need broke it i'm pretty sure this product without shipping was like under 10 pound i think it was um and literally for the price of it the outer packaging is brilliant like i've got no fault with it at all then the actual item is actually really luxurious so this is a nice like feeling fabric fabric you know what i mean and then you've got like the name at the bottom which has been nicely made and then you just twist it or oh, i can't even open it now twist and then and then you have it like you know what i mean plus then when you put the product on your hand it feels so creamy but yet light with a beautiful glow and it's like it's like did i pay how did i pay like 10 pounds for this under 10 pounds for this because it feels like a high-end product that you'll pay like nearly 40 quid for so yeah i'm kind of i'm kind of excited to use it but to be fair the only thing is though i wish i've got the club i am clutzy today i really am but anyway, as I was saying, it's a shame they don't have a bigger version of this, to be honest. Like, I think if they'd done a bigger version, that would be actually quite cool, to be honest. Because it it would. So, yeah, so this is what it looks like. This is the Beauty Hub uh, Baby Beam Dewy Filter Glow Base. So, yeah. Love, love the outer packaging as well. And I even, I even love this as well. Like, this is so cute. Like, because it's got, it, like, it ties in because it's got the purple there and it's got the purple, like, it's just like, love it. So, yeah, so, yeah, I hope uh, you enjoyed this TikTok, guys. I am now going to put this back in here so we can go and do it on my other TikTok. So, yeah, guys, I'll see you in a bit and hope you all enjoyed this unboxing. This unboxing will be up on Monday. Um, because I have the Tatty Lash unboxing coming up, going up tomorrow. Um, so yeah, so literally it's all of the, 
it's a bundle that I've ordered. Um, I do an unboxing of it and everything. So that will be up mon Monday. That will be up Friday, guys. So um, yeah, stick around for that. And then this unboxing will be up on Monday. And then I think probably Friday next week i'll probably do a whole look using obviously the glow beam the lip the p louise stuff and that lot so yeah hope you enjoyed this video and i will see you in a bit guys also i'm going to add in um a removal and a refresh of my lashes when i need to do them because i know that i showed the products but i'm going to show you how i use them and my techniques so yeah guys see you in a bit so guys, let's try this again because I've just done that and it stopped. So anyway, we've got a part up to unbox. Um, it comes this morning. Before I get into the unboxing, I want to say two things first. One, I will be pulling TikToks up on both channels on Monday and Friday. By the end of Christmas, I want to be pulling YouTube videos up on Instagram and Facebook as well. So basically on my platforms by Christmas I want to be in a routine of pulling videos up every Monday and Friday on them. First I'm starting with my TikTok and my YouTube channel um because I have been slacking with the videos on my YouTube channel but for the next two weeks I'm gonna be adding like doing random videos so yeah so um friday video will be the unboxing of my tatty lash um parcel monday one which is going to be this video is unboxing this one and then friday's video next friday will be um well this friday coming because by the time you see this it'll be monday so this friday it will be my full makeup routine adding in new products so yeah that's that said now number two i did an upset the other day and well last night so basically you know how i did a full tiktok video of me unboxing the beauty crop bundle and the uh lips uh p louise juice box well last night i accidentally deleted it off my off this account so what i had to do was on this account i had to search for my other tiktok account which is terry beauty boutique if you want to go and follow that be my guest you'll see it in the um the story that i shared of that video so i had to go on to that video share it to my story because i accidentally deleted it but anyway now that it's been shared to my story and now that you're still going to see the video anyway you know what it is it's it's one of them so anyway let's get into it so this is the parcel that we are opening i'm not going to show you the front because it's actually got um my address on so i'm not going to show you that because obviously i don't want no one knowing my address because you know what people are like these days stalkers like so you get the invoice to start off with i'm going to go with the invoice because to be fair don't get me wrong it's a basic invoice but the only thing is i wish that they had the price of the item how much it was with delivery and how much the total come to because if you're a person like me i can't remember how much this item was on its own and then with delivery so so yeah it's a shame they didn't pull it on the invoice but i'm covering that there because that's my name and my first name and last name but this is what it looks like it's got the order number the date your quantity the name of the product the price the um the name of the color you got the product number and then it's got like thank you for ordering and then it's got the beauty crop the address the email for if you have any concerns and then the address and then this little sticker thing was covering over the top so you could open it but i put it on there anyway so yeah so the only thing is with this invoice i'm a bit disappointed because i wish they put on like how much the product come how much the product the price of the product the price of the delivery and then the total they come to because then i could look at the invoice and tell you guys because my after i brought some i completely forget how much it cost on its own then how much it cost with delivery and what the end total was that's me being honest but that's me personally because obviously i i have a bright i have a memory like a goldfish i could forget something in two seconds so yeah but anyway this is the item 
This is a glow hub um baby beam dewy filter glowy base. Um packaging is A plus. Like even what they sent in is A plus because literally the top of it matches the thing and I think that's just brilliant. It's like the little details for me that I actually really love. Um like just having the packaging that it's coming matching the actual box of the item like that is it's it's a tiny detail for me that is what i've noticed with every unboxing i've done like the beauty crop the p louise the tatty lashes it's the the tension to detail is what is what like i'm like wow you know what i mean but anyway let's get into the actual item because i don't have long left 10 minutes, man. It, TikTok, come on, what are you doing? So, yeah, this is the item. Um, this is the name of my the one that I got. This is the Angel Beam. I had a look on TikTok, and everyone said that this one, that they really liked the colour of. So, I thought, you know what, let's get it. To be fair, the packaging is quite nice. So, this top bit here feels like it's silicon, and it's really nice and comfy. It don't feel like it's going to slip out your hands or anything. Um, even this bottom bit feels like it's made really good. So let's put a dot on the back of my hand. The amount of times I've done this, I'm surprised my hand is not beaming to the gods. Like I really am. But anyway, so that's what it looks like. Let's uh, blend it in. Like look at look at that glow though. Oh my god, that is so nice. The thing is though, it looks it feels like a high end product. Like, if someone told me, if someone put that on my face and asked me to guess what company it was from, I would have said Charlotte Tilbury or Mac or bloody Nars or Hourglass or something. Like, you know what I mean? Like, that just feels so nice. Um, I think I paid, I think this was actually under £10, I think. And then I think they added, like, £2 from a delivery, I think. I will put the price somewhere along in this video because obviously i can't actually remember how much it was this is where i wish they put it on the invoice you know what i mean but i will put it somewhere in the video in this video just to let you guys know how much the product was how much the shipping was and then how much the total was because obviously i can't remember for the life of me and when i edit this i will put it in so yeah but you know what? To be honest, it's quite good. The packaging, one hundred percent. What it come with in a star packaging, a star. The item, like the, the actual container of the item with the um, the glowy base in a star. The only thing I would say is obviously what I said about the invoice, and then I wish they'd done a bigger version of this. If you think if to be honest because if you're someone that wears makeup every day or you put this on every day i bet you're going through this like mad but obviously i don't put makeup on every day like the only thing i do is my lashes and then my lip gloss and then like um a lip balm or summer because obviously like, i don't put makeup on every day i don't do my face every day like you know what i mean but imagine if you're pulling this on every day i bet you go through it like mad but to be fair the tiktok that i watched she did say that you don't need a lot so um we'll see friday if i do because i'm going to be doing uh, a basic my makeup routine my basic not my glam just my basic kind of everyday makeup routine and i'll be adding this in and the um beauty crop powder that they sent me and the primer i'm going to be using so yeah guys i hope you enjoyed this video well tiktok hope you have had a brilliant day and i will see you in friday's video for my uh, makeup routine see you later guys hi guys welcome back to the channel uh well welcome back to the channel welcome back to like so at the minute i am literally filling my tablets back up with the ones that i ordered um i have done the tiktok videos ready for um monday i had to think then um so yeah i've done the tiktok videos ready for monday all i need to do is um obviously tomorrow i need to upload that tiktok of the um the tatty lash uh bundle uh 
and I need to tag them in it because every time I do a TikTok video of obviously me mentioning the brand, what I do is I will go through everything and tag every brand. So say if I do a video on TikTok of my full face makeup and that lot and I will tag in the if i say if i use like the glow recipe not the glow recipe what am i on about that the beauty crop powder that they sent me let me get it out um let me get them out and i'll give an example so say if i use this in the look and well i'm going to use it in the look anyway say if i use this in the look this is a beauty crop vitamin babe setting powder so if i use that i will tag beauty crop in my description same with the primer. This is Beauty Crop uh, Coconut Gold Perfecting Primer. When I use that in the video, I will, because I've obviously already tagging them in with the powder, I won't need to then tag Beauty Crop again because obviously the primer and the powder are both from them, so I don't need to tag them. But then when I use the Glow Hub um, Beauty, Beauty Beam, I think that's what it's called, I can't remember, and I just literally done a video. Beauty Beam in uh, Angel Beam. I will tag um, Glow Hub in the description. So, also, another thing I would do is, obviously, because I'll be wearing lashes that day, I will tag Tatty Lashes in the video in the description as well because of the lashes. Um, say if I... So, say I use... Which I probably will anyway. I'll use the P. Louise um, Juice Juice Box in popcorn in the video i will then tag p louise in the video just you know what i mean so every video that you do on tiktok every product that you use tag that brand unless you've already tagged them in in like if you've already tagged them oh i've just realized what i've done oh god so basically i'm here pulling in my tablets and i've realized i put my one other tablets in the wrong compartment so now i'm gonna have to sit here go through them all make sure the ones that i need that i've got the 50 on and pull them in the right box oh i give up one of them days today guys so this one is 50 so that can go in there So guys, after I've done this, I will be going to do something to eat because I need to do me something to eat to be fair because I'm feeling a bit peckish right now. So I'm feeling a bit peckish, so I'm going to go and do some food. I don't have a clue what I'm going to do though, but I know I want something to eat because I'm feeling hungry. That went in the wrong one, so... 50, 50, and I think that's all of them, thank God for that, I'm glad I noticed then, instead of noticing once I've literally done everything, because I would have been a little peed off, so anyway, as I was saying, um, so yeah, so once I've put all these tablets away, I will be then doing it in the bath, um first i'm gonna do me something to eat i'll probably only do something small to be fair because i don't know i just I don't, I don't feel very i don't feel hungry to the point that i could eat a massive meal i don't feel that hungry i just feel a bit hungry where i'll just have something small to eat and then if i feel hungry late more hungry later on then i'll do obviously a bigger meal um so yeah um uh, but once i do something little to peck on i will then go and get the bath ready um because to be honest i've just realized i went to put them in there when they need to go in a bag because i've got loads of these tablets so where's the bag gone there it is so the thing is though with this i have to put some of the tablets in a little bag because obviously the compartments are only small to fit a certain amount um so these ones will be going in this clear bag until that compartment is empty 
and then as soon as it's empty i will be refilling from this bag to that compartment and every little bag has um a little thing saying what it is and what milligram it is because obviously you know what i mean like some tablets look the same so you don't want to miss out the wrong ones so basically what i'm gonna do with these 200 milligrams i'm literally just taking them all out the um container and pulling them in this clear bag so that when that compartment over there is done i can refill them with these ones so then we got two more no we've got two more yeah we've got two more can ones to do so this is the only downside of having to fill and order your tablets because once you order your tablets and if you've left it to last minute like i have you have to refill everything again and then from refilling you have to then put them into my tablet box so yeah so that's the only downside to this but hey hope it needs to be done you know what i mean like um yeah so oh geez the only downside of this oh jesus oh dearly dearly me oh i dropped that one my bad so guys i've also been talking to my mom as well and about march or april time i'm gonna start getting the flat sorted because the thing is when you start painting because when it's cold when the flat's cold and when the paint's cold it don't dry properly so i'm gonna wait till about march or april time when it's a lot warmer so that when i put the paint on come night time it'll be dry so that is what i'm gonna do um oh i think that's everything apart from the busker pan way done so yeah so that's what i'm gonna do i've also got someone who's offered to help me with the painting and that lot because i want new flooring Oh, I need to pull them into here. I want new flooring in all the flats because obviously, like the old flooring, don't get me wrong, it's nice, but I'm kind of over the colour now. Like, so the flooring I've got now is a uh, lino and it's uh, the white wood effect. So don't get me wrong, when I seen it, I loved it. Like, literally, loved it. But now I'm kind of over it. Um, like i want new flooring so i'm going to be looking at flooring as well around that time um because also what i'm doing is when we actually start painting what i'm going to do next month is i'm going to order one of them paint gun things where you put the paint in the the bottom and you just spray it onto the wall so I'm going to get one of them because then it's going to make it a lot easier because the mount we have to do. So we've got to paint this room that I'm in, the kitchen, the toilet room needs another go over, the bathroom needs another paint over. Um, we've got to do the room that I'm going to be moving into. Yes, guys, I have decided to move into that room. Um like so i will be moving into that room and then this room will go back as my living room because obviously you know what i mean now that chris is not staying now um i can have the rooms back well he, he does still stay but like he doesn't stay as much as he used to because basically now i am better because i told you all about that little wobbler i had um but now that obviously I am on the men's, um, which I'm glad to be. Well, I wouldn't say I'm 100% amazing and like literally I could run a marathon. I'm not saying that. I'm saying that I'm better than I was because, you know what I mean? Like it was, it was a dark place um, and 
But I'm not saying that I'm 100% better. I'm not saying, away everything's fine now. No, I'm not saying that. I still have bad days, uh, but the good days overtake the bad days. So, yeah, that's the way I think of it anyway. And that's the way I'm going to think of it because, yeah, I have days where I'm worse than other days um and there's probably going to be weeks where i'm going to be fine and then there's probably going to be a week where i have like complete meltdown the whole week um but the thing is what i've learned with last year that it's okay to have them days and th this see this is another thing i want to learn this year for myself that it's okay not to be okay if you get what i mean like because obviously everyone's like oh i'm fine i'm fine but then like everyone's like really deep down i'm not and last year everyone really had a problem with saying listen i'm not feeling so good um i'm having a bad day but this year i don't i don't know man i think this year is something different like with everyone this year because like we have everyone supporting small brands and everything and we have a lot of people even big influencers coming out saying oh i'm not okay and to be honest i think this year it's 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 a year for people to be honest with themselves and say listen i'm not having a good day and to be honest i didn't really say it out loud last year like there's a few times where my mates have asked me oh are you okay and i've just said yeah i'm fine when really i'm not but i've learned my lesson and now i am not scared to say listen i'm having a bad day you know what i mean and sometimes there's going to be days where i'm having a bad day there's going to be days where i'm having a good day there's going to be weeks where i'm probably having a bad week or a good week it is what it is that's that's the kind of roller coaster you live when you have mental health like that that's what it is that's real life for you mate i like i hate sugarcoating it because i have mental health and when you have mental health like that is the roller coaster you living on like one day you'd be up here another day you'd be down here and it's just like it's just it's just it's just one of the roller coasters that you feel like it's going to be going on forever and ever but this year is a year where i want to try and help my mental health um this is why i've set up a load of habits and goals if you seen my video at the first of this year, um, you would have seen that I've got a, quite a lot of goals, quite a lot of uh, habits that I want to do. And to be honest, the personal ones are just for me and my mental health to feel better. Then we have the moving out ones, the driving, and then the work ones. I have already said this in a video, the work ones I'm gonna focus on at uh, the start of June this year i'm gonna start focusing on the work ones and then but for now i'm focusing on the personal ones so like repeating my spanish reading books um meditating journaling all that stuff like pulling makeup on doing my lashes you know what i mean getting my nails done just making myself feel like that little bit better um that is what i'm focusing on at the minute because i did i have I think, I don't know, I don't know if I've said it in this video or another video, that every two weeks I'm going to be adding in a different habit. Um, so, this this week I've, um, I had it, well, last week I added journaling into it, but this week I'm going to go back in and add journaling into it and meditation because um, I think the only one that I'm failing with at the minute is the reading because obviously I have a really low tension span and I could read one page and if I've got to go and do something then come back to read it again read again I have to read the whole page again so I think this is where I'm going to start doing not just reading but also listening to audible as well because that's another way of reading a book without you having to sit there and read it um so yeah so that's another one that i'm gonna add into because i think i'm gonna change the reading one to the audible book because like like you just get someone else because I, I literally read a book i have to get up and go say good toilet or summer and then i come back and then after i read the whole book again because i've lost where i was so and i couldn't get back into it 
So I think I'm going to change that one into listening to Audible more. So I will still be reading, obviously, books, but obviously I'll be listening to Audible more than just reading books. So say if one, one day I might my concentration is not as good as another day then that day i can listen to other books but then i still get the the good feeling of actually listening or reading a book so that's what i'm gonna do with that one um i'm also gonna add uh, meditation and journaling back into it um because i do really want to get into these habits because it will make me feel better and then when i feel better my mental health and my mind will feel better so yeah that's what's going to be planning but this week and last week i'm adding last week i added journaling too which i kind of went off um but this week i'm going to add journaling and meditation back into my routine because I really want to get these goals achieved and I have been talking a load of rubbish for a, how long so I'm going to go and run and do me something to eat because now I have done the tablets they've all done they are all in their boxes and then I've moved the ones I'm in the boxes into the weekly well yeah the day and night tablet box so then that's all sorted so now I am going to go and do me something to eat and then I'm going to run a bath because I need a bath and I'm going to meditate in the bath as well. So, yeah, why not? You know what I mean? Why not? Because multitasking, man, you can get so much more done. So, I'm going to go and do that. And I will come back to you guys in a bit once I'm out of the bath and everything. Bye, guys. Okay. So, hi, guys. I'm back. Um, really? So, I have um been in the bath got out i've done my skincare i repeated my spanish i've read a book i have meditated i have done my journal so will you stop please stella it's very rude you done that's what i thought so yeah just ignore my hair i am kind of letting it grow out at the minute because i've decided i want side um i forgot what they're called but at the minute they're a little too short to go into that style because i need them to grow like about that much so yeah stella no can you move please jeez because like to be fair i don't know because don't get me wrong, I do like having a fringe, but I don't know. I think I'm just so over it now. I'm not sure. Like, obviously, if if I wanted, if I wanna keep my fringe, I will like go and trim it because obviously it needs trimming. Like, but I don't know. I'm I'm just undecisive, guys. So do let me know what you guys think because I, I'm I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Because don't get me wrong, I want side, um, are they called curtain bangs or something like that? I'll call them what they're called. I'll try again later because I'll call them what they're called. But, like, I don't know. Like, like don't get me wrong, I love the, the full fringe. Like, I really do. I love it. But, I don't know, I think I'm just so over it that i want to change this eyelash is getting on my nerves and i don't know why no actually i think it's a contact lens but anyhow oh well leave it it'll sort itself out soon um as i was saying um but yeah i'm undecisive of what i want to do with my hair like i've got bleach and i really want to bleach it as well but then i'm like what do i do because i've seen so many styles on face on like google and facebook and i'm like hmm i like that one and i like that one and i like them all and i'm not just like hmm what do i do
because don't get me wrong, wrong, I love a fringe, but at the minute, I think I'm so over it now, like, yeah, I think I'm so over it, Stella, no, jeez, I'm trying to have a conversation here, and you're interrupting, anyway, um, what was I saying, oh yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to do, guys. Like, do I let them grow out? Because that's what I've already started doing. I've let them grow out. And then, because that's how long they am now. Um, Because when I used when I was keeping the full fringe, I literally used to cut them as soon as they got to there. Because, obviously, I didn't want my fringe further than my eyebrows. Like, literally, my fringe would literally level with my eyebrows because I didn't want them any further than that. Plus, when you've got glasses on, it's kind of annoying because when you've got glasses on, the fringe keeps hitting the glass. Um, because if I pull them that side, it looks it looks weird because of obviously it being a full fringe. But I'm thinking at this point, I'm just going to let them grow and then obviously cut them into... Um, I call them what they're called, but you have like two either side and then I swoop. So, yeah, I think that's what I'm thinking of doing. And I've got my hair in my mouth. <laughs> that's not nice. Um, but yeah, let me go. Let me guys, let me know what you think because obviously I'm still gonna let them grow. I'm not gonna dye my hair yet until probably next week when I've decided what I'm gonna do with it because. Mm, I'm still so undecisive on what I want to do because basically my idea when I first thought oh I'm going to dye my hair was I was going to have the money pieces done and then it going into the back but then I realised I've got a full fringe so I don't know how exactly that was going to work because then I have to do my whole fringe and then like the sides going into the back but then it's going to be too much with the fringe being done and the back you know what I mean so I don't know. Just let me know what you think down below, guys, because I am so undecisive. I literally don't know what to do when everything. So yeah, but I'm I'm thinking of doing a TikTok video of makeup because because I'm just sitting here and I'm like watching TV and I'm like, mm, I got the urge to play with some makeup, but then I guarantee I'll start doing it and start winging it. And then I get bored off right through. So I think what I'm going to do is go back to watching my TV. Then do a video tomorrow on TikTok of my makeup. If I've still got the urge to do makeup. Because I have these random things where I get motivated to do one thing one time. And then I give up halfway through. So, and I don't want to do that tonight. Because obviously with me having to take it off and everything. So, I think I'm going to leave it to tomorrow. And if I still feel the same tomorrow, then do it tomorrow. So, guys, I'm going to go back. Oh, trying to put my air bubbles back on my wrist. So, I'm going to go back to watching my film. Well, my TV series. I'm still watching NCIS Hawaii. 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 That's what I meant to say. But, yeah, guys, let me know what you think I should do with my hair. Because I don't know. But, yeah, um... This video will be edited tomorrow because I'm going to video up until I go to bed. And then I will pull it up tomorrow. Um, so, yeah. I'll come back to you in a bit, guys. Guys, it is now Friday. I hope you enjoyed this uh, little short vlog. Um, I'm going to now edit this and get it up for you guys so i hope you enjoyed and i'm gonna go and cut my fringe because even though i'm growing it out i think i need to just trim it anyway so yeah hope you enjoyed this and i'll see you soon guys i will see you in this is gonna for monday's video bye guys